Welcome back, everybody. Uh, we're doing our first finance video on this channel. And real quick, let me let me say I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not a CPA. This is what I did that worked for me. You may like it. You may not. You know, you can cherry pick what you like, whatever, you know, but I'm just telling y'all what I did that worked for me very well. Again, you know, if you like it, you like it, you don't, don't, whatever, that's fine. This is what I did, and it worked perfectly fine for me. And, uh, yes, I know there's other finance channels and podcasts, and mine will be a little bit different because I feel I'm a little bit more relatable with a lot of people because, you know, I'm a military veteran. You know, I worked in warehouses. I've been in the trucking industry, um, in the oil and gas, so... Regular average jobs, you know, I didn't do anything fancy, crazy, you know, just, I'm just an average person, you know, but, uh, but yeah, again, this is what I did that worked out for me and I've been doing it for years. And when people ask me advice on, you know, stuff like this, I, I got my little blueprint. It's what I, you know, I show them, Hey, it's simple, common sense. And you'll be surprised that, like, it's common sense, easy stuff, but people will do the opposite or just, it's mind-blowing. But, yeah, so we need to get back to the basics of finances. We, we need to know where our money is going monthly, you know, because if you don't know where your money is going monthly, then you can't you know, build future wealth or you can't look into future investments because you don't know where your money's going. So how can you build wealth and look at future investments if you don't know where your money's going? So this is common sense, basic stuff I know, but this is what I did and it worked fine for me. So let's get into this video real quick. So obviously we need a job. Or some kind of source of income and if you can try to work the minimum or try to at least get 40 40 hours if you get more hey that's awesome that's cool but the goal is to get 40 hours because that's what that's what's gonna help us a lot it's just 40 hours and more so I'm just gonna throw a number out there for just the video purposes to make it easy math so you need a job obviously and the job pays you 20 bucks an hour and you get 40 hours it comes out to 800 a week four weeks in a month so you make thirty two hundred dollars so you know yeah I know it's uh it's gross not take home taxes I, yes I know this is just for the video purposes and you're making thirty two hundred you plug in whatever num whatever your number is or your salary and you know and that's what you know you make so now we got to figure out our expenses. So if you have a mortgage, rent, write it down. The whole principle, the whole practice of this video is to figure out your expenses, to figure out your expenses. So write it down or do a spreadsheet. But the whole main po uh, focus, the whole goal of this is to write it down so you know, so you see where it's going. I just, you're thinking, you're guessing, no, write it down or do a spreadsheet. So you know what you're looking at. So I already covered, uh, so your mortgage rent, you wrote that down and you pay whatever you pay. And then if you have a car payment, write it down. And then your car insurance. And then if you pay child support and whatever you pay monthly for credit cards. And here's the one where it gets people. Cause they got me for a while, but, but people don't pay attention sometimes. And just, this is where a lot of money is spent or could be spent without you really knowing, or you forget about it. And that's uh memberships, streaming services, like, you know, gym, uh, Amazon prime, Netflix, Hulu, Paramount and so on. So write that down, like whatever memberships you have and services you use, and then um, your utilities, you know, water, light, internet, and then groceries. 
this could be different. Yeah, I know. But this is just uh, an exercise to help you write down what you spend. Just it's like an estimate, I guess, or you know, like four hundred bucks a month in groceries. So you know, whatever. Cell phone and whatever other you know expenses you have. You know, you babysitter or dog grooming. You know, just write down your expenses, whatever you have. A lot of this stuff may pertain to you. It may not. Like I only I have some of this stuff, but other than that, like this is all basic. And once you can figure out all your expenses and you know where your money's going, then you're able to move on to the next step. You know, if you want to save money, you can probably cut some of the expenses out because you know where your expenses or where your money's going on these expenses. And then again, uh, this is a uh, video by video and. Doing this one first, just the basics. If you get anything out of this video, just figure out where your money's going. Just if you get anything, just figure, just get that. Where is your money going monthly? And once you figure that out, then you can go on to the next step. Whether you want to save some money, well, then you know your expenses. Hey, I, you can cut this one out, cut that out, or future investments. Hey, you know I got so much money left over monthly that I can look into this and so on. But you got to go back to the basics. Again, I said it over and over. Basics, you know, figure out where your money's going because a lot of people don't know where the money's going because they forget that they have this uh, app or streaming service. They forget like, oh, I forgot about that because I was one of them. I forgot I had Peacock twice, but I was always working, so I would forget. But, I mean, it's simple stuff, common sense. But yeah, just, you know, this, this is what I did and it worked for me. I knew where my money was going monthly and I could move on to, you know, future investments and, and so forth. But yeah, common sense, basic, just figure out where your money's going, people. Just know where your money's going and then you can go from there. But yeah. So hopefully this uh, little rant, this little video helps you out. And um, next video, we'll see what we talk about first. I need y'all to figure out where your money's going and then you can move on. So figure this out and then catch my next video and we'll go from there, guys. All right. So catch y'all on the next one. Hey.